Right, to install this library that can take any text and then convert it into speech, let's go ahead and open up the terminal in here. So terminal or command line if you're on Windows and then new terminal and you've seen this quite a lot. So this is where all the output from our program shows up. So to install the text-to-speech library, type pip and then three and then install pi and then t t s x three. So this means Python text to speech and then x3 is the version. So let's press enter. And now this goes ahead and installs the library. And it's as simple as that. And then to use it, let's go ahead and close this. And at the top, let's import the library so type import and then pi text to speech or actually pi tts x3 and there we go so this is pretty much everything that we have to do now what we're going to do here is the following well, right after we import let's go ahead and say pi t uh, ts3 and then dot and then speak so we have a speak method and here let's have the text so within single quotes let's say hello let's run this and see what happens hello and you can see that it said hello so this is really really great so let me close this and what I'm gonna do here is the following. I'm going to create a function that will wrap this so we don't have to always say pi and then ttsx3. So it's, it's, it's just too much, right? So we're going to do this. We're going to take this and then we're going to have a def and then say speak. And then in here, we're going to take the text. So say text and then inside paste this, right? And instead of hello, we're going to pass the text. So just like that. And now it means that we can just invoke this function right here and not having to say this pi tts x3. So right after we add our name, let's say here speak and then we want to pass hello within quotes. So hello and then plus and then name and then plus and then how are you today with question mark. And let's run the program now. And you can see that it says, what is your name? So here, let me say, for example, Eba. Hello, Eber, how are you today? And you saw that it said, hello, Eber, how are you today? So I'm going to cancel out of this because I don't want to complete the CV right now. But you see that with this, you know, you have so many ideas, right? So for example, you might want to take this speak method and then, for example, ask for the phone number, right? So let's say you say speak. And then you want to take this question and then put it here and then paste that. So if I run this once more, let me say Nelson. Oops, not there. I want to write in here. So let me say Nelson. Hello, Nelson. How are you today? What is your phone number? And you can see that now I can put my phone number, right? So this is really, really great. And for the email, we're not using the speak functionality. So there you have it. So I just wanted to show you this awesome package because it's quite amazing of how much you can do with programming. So this is all for this video. Let me just close this and I'm going to press control and then C here to kill this program and then close this. So this is all for this video. 
if you have any questions on this please do let me know um but yeah so i had fun teaching you this entire project i hope that you also had fun uh, so i think the next thing for us now is to take this project and then make it ready so that we can build a portfolio and that's what we're going to do next